Hey everyone, it's Calvin, also known as Romer, and this is Xenoblade Chronicles 3. This is my first started playthrough of Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Look at that broken flame clock. We destroyed it. We absolutely ended it. The crew's here together. Oh, we didn't get to look off the back of the cliff here. Man, so cool. Like, it's crazy how, like, everyone here lives. You'd have to have some sort of, like, you know, crazy... I don't know, crazy, um... Resistance to like high altitude because I would just not be breathing. Hello, Rita. Consul's gone. That's that. Never liked him though. He thought well of Dame Alex. Uh, supported her. For that, I'm grateful, but only that. Dame Alexandria. Don't you think it's about time for a meal? Yes, of course. Uh, we're gonna get a meal here. We, I will be doing, the, like I said before, uh, how I'm basically going to be doing a lot of the side quests in this game is that I'll do the basic side quests kind of like off camera, and that's just because we're going to be taking forever to get through the game anyway. Uh, a lot of the exploration and hero quests will be done, oh, that actually looks kind of nice, will be done in front of you guys, not, nothing to discuss right, <laughs> there's nothing to discuss right now. Uh, about the supplies sent to Colony Tau. They can wait. We've had a change of plans. Our next delivery is now going to Colony 4. Colony orders goes. So that's going to be another side quest as well. I guess it's probably going to be the other aspect of it. This is just a beautiful game. Have you seen the site of the medical supplies in Colony 4? You can add equipment and other cylinders to this too. They're running out of resources all across the board. There we go. And like basically, I do take time. Sometimes, like, I'm just, I'll be in bed, and I'll take the switch out of the dock, and I'll do a bunch of the side quests, because I feel like that's the fun way of doing it, you know what I mean? Like, just, just on the side. So are you finding life in Silver Colony? Everything about it is so wildly different compared to back home. I'll definitely be bringing some learning back from it, however small. Hang in there with that. Naturally. Try to build up a little bit of affinity with these guys as well. Thorben. Baron Thorben. Oh, we already talked to Riza. Sorry, Riza. Some person Riza is. Colony lines really fallen by the wayside. Both the rank and their army numbers are down. Oh, we'll have to go back to Colony 9. Let's continue to watch your Collectopedia cards closely. There might come a time when we have to lend them a hand. We should actually do that too. At some point as well. We haven't done the Collectopedia in a, in a hot minute. In a hot, hot minute. So let's start off, let's just go into the quests and do a collect some Collectopedia stuff. Uh, I'm Colony 4. Looks like we're all done. I mean, it's worth it for a bit of experience, a bit of affinity. Uh, Colony like Gamma. For Zakir. Zakir some boy. Uh, Colony 4. Happy. 75 affinity as well. Let's happy. go for it. We gotta get as much affinity as possible. Right now, I'm thinking we're going to be going back like to, um, well, there's a certain place we have to go to get another hero quest that I missed as well. We will hopefully eventually be going to get to the queen. As I said, I'm going back to work literally in two days. Uh, so at this stage, like, you know, doing big, chunky, big boy episodes uh, isn't always going to be on the card. You know, we'll do what we can, but it's not always going to be happening, you know? More colony for for Kukucha. Oh my god, you're just getting a lot of a Kukucha. Any more for Kukucha? Is Kukuchi just oh Kukucha doesn't want any more. There we go again. Colony Four is getting all the luck. I hope it made them happy. I love her just like yeah, just like just send all this stuff to them. I guess this is what happens when you build it up and don't do it for a while though, so that's my own problem. You know what I mean? That's not an issue though. Like it's like, kind of nice. It's like a serotonin and dopamine all the way through. I hope it made them happy. I hope it made them happy. There we go. A bit more. You get, you take all the stuff you want, Colony Four. You take it all away from us. <laughs> I mean, it's what we're doing. Like, it's why we're doing this. We got it all as requested. This is my own fault. 
Any more? Do you want? Do you want a bit more? Do you want? Do you want a bit? Do you want a bit more? There we go. <laughs> like it's like again like it's like I, I left it for so long at this point like like you guys are just watching me press A over and over again. Oh my god. <laughs> Here we go. Anyone? Sol Solon. Oh, Solon has no more to give. Okay, let's try Kali thirty. Oh, Ritz, okay, and, and Dinky Dink, Dinky Dinky, I forgot about Dinky Dinky. How could we ever forget about Dinky Dinky? Widge Widge! <laughs> Jesus Christ, oh, there's Chickadee. Chickadee, take all of her stuff, I love you. She's such a sweet little kid. Uh, Carson as well. Any more? Yeah. I just wanna say, you know what it means? This is like instant dopamine over and over again. It just feels good every single time. Oh my lord. <laughs> I just like worried about what you guys think. Okay, there's uh, there it is. For glory. So we got like a lot of affinity there. A lot of affinity there for Colony 4. Oh my god, look at that. It's so worth it. Look at all that. Look at that. It's so worth it, man. It's so worth it. Huh. So worth it. Wait, there's another container over here. Man, I'm just like, I don't know, like, I feel like so grateful to be playing a game like this. You know what I mean? I feel so, I know it sounds weird, but like, I love, I love games like this. And I love how magical they feel. I love how it feels like we've been on such a long journey, how these characters, like, I care about them so much at this stage. Let's just sneak a peek. It feels so freaking good. Okay, so next thing we're gonna have to go to send is chatting away to someone there. The next place we're going to go to, I think it's in the Pentadas region, in Colony Lambda. We're going exactly here, here to Colony Lambda. In Colony Lambda, we will do a quest. I'm guessing it's uh, Izzard, right? It's Commander Izzard. And I kind of like want to like chat with Commander Izzard anyway. He owes me money, you know? Commander Izzard owes me money. No, he doesn't. We're still collecting <laughs> like little up on coins. Okay, so we have a question mark right here. There's also a container behind here. It's actually fun moving around as Mio. She's actually like very agile for um a cat. Who'd have thought? Let's just sneak a peek. Like I never thought a cat could be so agile. I never thought a cat could be this agile. Well, let's go to talk to Commander Izzard. Hello, Commander Izzard. What's wrong, Commander? Hmm. Oh, it's you guys. The Ferranus was heavily damaged during the battle. Do you remember? As a result, some of our remote administrated auto. I think Commander Izzard is such a handsome dude. Instructions. I'm not 100% on the techno babble, but that doesn't sound good. Indeed. I've sent some of our tech guys over, so we'll know soon enough. Do you really need the machines? Are you thinking there might be another battle? It's nothing like that, I assure you. Colony Lambda is now focused on ether mining, and... Whoa, 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 whoa. What? what was that? We just received word of a tunnel collapse. What? I'll be there oh, was there someone in there? Are the troops assembled? They're all in position. I mean, like, there's someone in there. That's that's horrific. We're gonna, have to, yeah, we're gonna have to do something right now. Sorry about this. After you took the trouble to come all the way here, Commander, please let us lend a hand. Exactly. Only if you're sure. But your help will be welcome. Roger that. I love how much respect Tyan has for Izzard. Okay, that's great. And we have, uh, so he's gonna be the hero quest now. Yay, here we go. Great. Unwavering resolve. I like to have, like, no loose ends, kind of, in, like, and the thing is, a lot of people kind of watch this from, like, a perspective of, like, maybe, like, Calvin playing platformers or Calvin playing, like, uh, other games and things like that. Um, what you'll notice about me playing JRPGs is that, like, I don't like many loose ends. I don't mind do- oh, god, I, I did not- I did not mean to do that, but hey, I thought there was, like, a gap, a uh, thing in between. 
But like, what you'll notice is that like I'm not a big fan of like leaving hero quests to decide like to decide before we do the main quest. Are you headed for Kevis Castle? If so, you want to ascend the Great Falls and then cut through Mac of the Wildwood. Man, we should totally do that. I do like though that they they're they're still talking to us as if we haven't gotten there because they don't know. They don't freaking know. Selen, how are you doing? Oh, it's you. None other. So you've been visiting Lambda, uh, uh, Selen. Yeah, it's a really awesome colony. I'm learning new stuff every day. Have you met Varen from the Engineering Corps? He's been good enough to school me on some new things. He's a really great guy. I'll put all his advice to good use. That's for sure. Look forward to a whole new colony town. Oh, so that's how they're doing. Okay, so I guess we're going to be heading off in a whole new direction. Hoizumi. We have a little camp out here. Yeah, and so now we're leaving. Okay, so whereabouts is there somewhere on the map that we can like travel to to make it a little bit easier? Uh, let's get rid of it. Oh, it's right there. Oh, it's it's the place we were before. So this okay, that's cool. At first I thought it was just like hey, you get to see the other side, but it makes sense that we would be right here at the tunnel as well. The tunnels are up ahead. I like the what kind of is there gonna be though? I'm guessing like he's probably gonna be like I don't know, so kind of like a mi like he'd be really cool as like a mixture of like healing and like offense, kind of like the way uh, we have uh, what's the name of the hero again? Because we have a bunch of heroes, kind of like the way that um, Dawn Hero. Uh, uh, no, no, that oh, so he is here. He is healing. Okay, so it's the same. Uh, no, here we go. Wait, what? A oh, current hero. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, what? That's not Izzard. I got so confused. Uh, inscrutable teach. So he actually is a healer. Okay, but like with a different weapon altogether. That's cool. We have a good balance. We definitely have a good balance. I think we need less defenders because like you don't need many defenders in the group at any one time, in my opinion, anyway. So that kind of makes sense. So the tunnel's collapsed. We're probably gonna have to. I see some people on the other side there. The tunnel walls should have been stabilized. What happened? Hey, look over there. It's collapsed. Ah, we got monsters. We do got monsters. Living in a place with elevated ether concentration, then found their way in here. We better get there quick. But there's no direct path there. We'll have to go around. You've got Lebnuses, don't you? Wanted to make short work of these things. But we need permission from each squad's leader to activate a Lebnus. Oh, come the snuff on. This is an emergency. Yeah, yeah, true. Exactly. You stay here on standby. There might be another clap. I think we'll that's one of the on biggest alone. issues we've seen throughout like a lot of the colonies is that like there's a lot of people who are very like steadfast in their ways. Uh, the but the leaders are kinda like have seen more have interacted probably more, you know? Oh, he's do is doing a very good job here. Well done, Izzard, my boy. Inform the other troops. Good Izzard! Yes, sir. Izzard! Now, all of I don't know why I'm saying this. We'll be fine, Commander. You can count on us. Understood. I'm sorry for dragging you into this. Jesus, no worries at all. Not one worry in my mind whatsoever. So we have to just travel over here, okay. First off, we'll need to find a way up. So we probably should have done this quest. Oh. Oh, hello. We're back. We're back, everyone. Okay. I love this. This is one of my favorite movesets. Like it's just like a, like the, the the it's it like you see when a weapon hits. For me, like the reason why I like it so. Oh, we have to change your uh, arts as well. The reason I like it so much is because there's like a like an actual feeling of like weight to it. It feels like it does hurt and it does quite a bit of damage too. You know, it's nice. Like look at this. Like it feels pretty freaking good every time you do it. Wait, three people are dead. What happened? Okay, okay. Calm down, everyone. Calm down. Calm, everyone, everyone, take a breather here. Bad. This is terrible. Imagine we actually destroyed this thing. Look at us, like we were like so confident going into it. Let's just get rid of the Kevis blocker at the very least, like. At the very least, like. 
Now get up me up. Come on, come on. Why can't I help you up? Because I'm not a healer? Ah! <laughs> Run! Sheath, 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 sheath. Oh, thank God. Everyone, we're going back in to kill these guys. We're not letting them get the better of us, okay? Let's change our arts around. It's not happening, guys. Calvin, you might want to just, like, let it go. No! I can't. I can't let it go. Energy grenade actually might be really fun to mix with, uh... Oh, okay, can't... Okay, that's fair enough. That Then crash out? Divine protection as well. Leaping current. Spear point thrust. Let's try that. Anyone else need some, uh, arts added? Oh, Izzard has a kind of a similar move to uh, Mio's original stuff. That's kind of cool. Nice. Is everyone ready? We're heading back in in a second. If there's only two of them, if they respond, we'll give up. Where's Tyon? Actually, there he is, yeah. Okay, they respond. Here we go, guys. I'll follow your lead. I'm trying to get their attention. Just don't let, just don't let anyone, just don't let them see us. Don't let them see us. Don't let them, guys, just don't let them, just don't let us die. Guys, just, it's Izzard! Oh, Commander Gizzard! <laughs> Please! Oh my god, no, wrong one. We want to fight th this one over here. This time no one die. Are you ready, Uni? Yeah! Oh my god, I'm so, I'm so, this is like so silly. I should, I should like not be doing this. I should just let us like. We're not gonna get the big move, but hey look, at least we'll kill a Kevin's blocker. You know what I mean? At least we'll kill a Kel with Kevin's blocker, Ke Kev Kevin blocker like you. <laughs> yeah, we're not getting the cancelling attacks very well. Which is fair enough. Actually, really cool move. I love the blade. Okay, let's try our best with this. Oh, chain attack. Yeah, for sure. Let's do a chain attack on this thing. This person, I should say. Uh, let's start with a lightning quick. What's your ability at yours? I'm actually excited to see. Guarantees Bravo ready when Hero completes an order, so we have to let them complete the, the order. Yeah. Right through Izzard. Um, let's try... Then... We'll go for this, which I love this move. It looks so good and actually does quite a bit of damage. Um, 40, so we can complete the order right now. Razor Wind. Oh, that looks so cool. It's like Razor Leaf from Pokemon. That looks so cool. And we got a Bravo as well. Mio is awesome, man. Mio is awesome. There's a Bravo. And we got two reactivations from that. And then we'll do a Brave Assault. And we'll do uh, another Hidden Thorn. Then I'll do this. Oh, yes. Heal everyone up a bit. Then I'll do another one of these to get a Bravo. This time we'll do uh, Razor Wind because it's the coolest move I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Look at this. Look how cool that looks. Heroic Chain as well, like get another Bravo on our hands. I forgot you still have that uh, uh, thing there. I wonder who's gonna, I say it has to be Tyon that, that it gets Izzard's move. Like it has to be, right? Like there's no way it could be anyone else at this stage in the game. From my perspective, anyway, there could be no one else. Right? Like, I, I think I think for sure, like, it, there's no way it could be anyone else. I, I was so sure that Lands, like, that Lands was going to get the uh, last ability with, um, or the ability before that with uh, Ashira. But I think it's just because, like, it, he didn't connect with her. He just, like, liked her a lot, you know? Like, and I think Uni, like, had some friction with her. So, like, it kind of made sense to go with that story point. But still, I thought, like, Lanza would have been a great choice, too. Razor Wind time. Limits on bound. See, what? yeah, it, it's whoever you use first, is it? That gets it, like, it changes every time. This is the 
Yeah, this is this feels good. This feels good that we did this, to be honest. <laughs> this feels really good. Nice. Chain attack complete. We did a good damage as well. And we conquered this thing. This person. This Kavisi soldier. We did it, guys. Well done. Let's switch to... Noah for a bit. Actually, I feel like Mio didn't get enough time to travel around the place. Not that she even cares. <laughs> Not that she's like, why aren't, I, why aren't I traveling around here? So do we have to travel across the bridge here? How do we get up here? I'm guessing we have to somehow get up on top here. I have no earthly idea how we're going to get up there. Maybe from here? No. Maybe from the- oh, from over there, maybe? I'm not quite sure. Wait, do we go down to go up, maybe? Maybe go over here? The hero quest in this game is although we've encountered so many different and interesting and varied heroes. That it really does feel like we're at like a point where I'm... Um, you know, like... Anything could happen with these characters. I feel like they're all really fun to, to use and to... How, do we, how are we going to go up there? Uh, and not only that, but like the inheritance of these is really cool too. So we're up this way. There's an Aether channel here. Oh, there's like a cable here. Would that be the best way to get up here? Mighty confused on the... Oh, wait. That's sure. Oh, I forgot about this. Show quest route. Yeah. Grand. Yeah, yeah, okay. I mean, this is the perfect time to use it. This is the exact time to use it. Not when we're just like, hey, a tiny bit stuck. It's like, hey, we don't know where to go. This is the perfect time to use it. I don't like using it all the time because it's kind of fun just like traveling around the place. But you guys have seen me use it quite a few times, like maybe two or three times. And there's a elevator over here. Wait, really? You want to fight us, Scorebox? I mean, okay. I mean, I'm not going to complain about you fighting a Scorepox. I would kind of like to not. You're a great little Scorepox. The best Scorepox around. Here we go. Look at these guys just waiting around here. British. He's a British ash bar. Oh, they look so cute when they're, like, level 25, you know, when they're, like, way lower level than you. They're, like, adorable now. You know what, mate? Are you a British ash bar? You know what? Okay, here we go. Elevator time. I hate the waiting part. By the way, I love the accents in the game. Uh, it's the same with Dragon Quest. I love the British accents in, in, in video games like that. Uh... It, like to me, like it, it, it's it's awesome. Like it's like it's a JRPG staple, a staple of JRPGs. Oh, because now we can turn this off for sure. We're up here now. Oh, got a rare duda right here. A rare duda. Or maybe we can turn it off. We'll see. I think it's. I think we can turn it off at this point. At this point. Minus, oh, we've been in this cave before, I think, but we went a different way, possibly. We'll see. I feel like I've seen these creatures before. I feel like I've fought these exact guys before. Yeah, these level 22 guys are going to give us nothing. Going to give us absolutely nothing. We're almost double their freaking level. You know what I mean? We're almost double the, uh, the abilities at this point. Hey, Drifter Scorebox, don't even try it. Don't even try it, my buddy. This way, I guess? Yeah. We're just double checking now. Yeah. I know, I see. There's actually a container on top of here now. Can we actually, uh... What is... You okay? Do you understand the difference here, Drifter Scorebox? Like, I, I admire the bravery. I just don't admire the bravery. MVP. You're all thinking it. 
I mean, yeah, we're constantly thinking about how you're the MVP. Consistently. Like, you are the MVP. You're also, you know, the boy. Yeah, we're gonna we, we we I used quite a bit on the the hulks that we saw. Oh, there's a container right here. Perfect. Let's just sneak a peek. Sneak a peek. We're robbing this container, Mio. We ain't sneaking a peek. These drifter guys are like really brave, and you gotta admire it in a way, right? Which way do you want us to go? This way? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Wait. Was there an elevator around here? Around this location? Not to worry, just stick to the plan. Oh, it's 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 I think it's right here. Okay. <sighs> Mr. Scorpox. You're wasting our time. You can go about your business. I don't need to worry about you. Oh my god, it's a big boy. It's a queen, but like we don't even have to worry about that either because like this is decent, right? That queen to do nothing. You know, that queen to do nothing at this stage. Scary before. Yeah, we just have to use the elevator over here. Wait, for real? Why are you go? Oh, it's a score. Another score box. I'm hiding over here. You can't see me over here. You can't see me over here, score box. Okay, let's just kill it then. Why are you impeding our. You're level 27. Why are you impeding us? I wouldn't worry about proving yourself useful, Noah. I mean, like, seriously, like, they're like... Like, we're not gonna worry about this. You guys stay here, okay? We're here. Oh, I bought my two boys with me. Wait, it's the wrong way. I think I went the wrong way. Oh no, nine meters right here. Okay, so it is here. I forgot there was a supply drop in the last step, so too that that's probably well gone at this stage. Like, who's gonna move this? The beefy boys? Okay, the beefy boy and uh, not so beefy girl. Should have brought Senna out for this. Like, should be respectful to Senna, the leader of the beefy boys. Can anyone hear me? We're here to help. Commander, we're safe. No casualties here. Looks like there weren't too many working this deep inside. I'm glad everyone's unharmed. I didn't think there'd be a cave in here, considering the geology and with this level of structural support. That goes over I my head, the buddy. The cave wall was weak enough for the monsters lurking there to break through. When the excavation uncovered an area of concentrated deposits, the monsters that lived there must have sensed a chance. The ether find is good news, but for now, let's get everyone out. There might be more monsters. We better keep an eye out. Noted. We're close to the site of the cave in. Let's pick up the pace. Yes, sir. But where are we? The thing is, I like, so like, I like that as well. Though they show that like Izzard like has genuine concern. For like everyone here. Oh, there's like so many like. Oops, they found us. Which oh, okay, let's oh. So they're gonna just my worst enemy, the drifter score boxes. But like I love that there's genuine concern for Izzard, but also like there's so much intelligence in as well. You can see exactly why there was so much respect for him from Tyon's perspective as well. Which is probably why like at first like it probably hurt more than anything like that to like have this drifting a part of them as well. You know, and I also to hear those things from his mouth, even though I know that it was just kind of, you know, it was, there was some truth to his feelings. There obviously was like maybe like something else like there where it's like, hey, like he, he doesn't feel exactly like this, you know? Like this is just like an overextent, like without the, what, what were they saying? Like it's his feelings without the heart, right? Without the actual heart of it, you know? Because we have, we have friends that like we want to like shake and be like, hey, stop doing this. 
But without the heart, that's exactly what, what kind of happened. You'd like fall apart. You probably wouldn't be friends ever again. Oh, that was a lot of healing too. Oh, there's still some more Drifter score boxes. But there's like little Agni and uh, robots here too. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, don't mind if I do as well. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do as well. So what else we have? We have one more Drifter score box. You poor thing. It is. It's part of the quest, Mio. I understand where you come from. Like, I agree with you. You're you're literally preaching to the choir here. Nice. That looks somewhat cleaned up. I guess riding a leftness meant they avoided any serious injuries. Thankfully. A little silver lining to a great big cloud. Glad to hear. Tyon? No, all of you. Thanks for your assistance. You saved us. On the contrary, Commander. We were just following your orders. Right. We could only react so fast thanks to your quick thinking. That's about as much as I can do. The people of Colony Lambda, and you as well, all knew what needed to be done. And due to that, the rescue was a success. I can't thank you enough. You've even managed to secure a nearby ether deposit. I'm a bit jealous. Yes. Actually, our troops reported a harvestable ether source recently. And with enough resources in the bank, perhaps the colony could have some peace of mind. Nice. I hear a fair few colonies are lacking ether. Everyone knows that we're nothing without it. Everyone in Lambda knows to be prepared to do anything in their power rather than lose it. By the way, how are your travels? Our travels? Sometimes I'm envious of folk like you. Strong willed and forging ahead. Well, we're not Especially when you have to like like Actually, look I after think a being colony. A commander is a pretty big deal in its own way, eh? Yeah. Smoldering Kamaravi and the famed silver coat certainly are. But I'm not that kind of lone pioneering type. It's interesting to hear him bring it up after like they're gone. You know what I mean? Same. I know my own weakness. Arr, I guess he did, I guess word didn't travel. For, I guess I know it's before that, but in you tie on, I abandoned all thought. The consul sensed my weakness, knew I'd pass my responsibility to another, and took merciless advantage of it. Oh, that's one thing I learned from losing. Ironically, if I hadn't experienced that loss, I I'd never have come to understand this feeling in me. Sorry, no one needs to hear all that. Ah, yes. I owe you all, don't I? Would you come to the commander's office later? I'll be waiting. Of course. I don't know, like, I just love... I just, I, there's so much, like, of a, a great feeling off Izzard, like, you know? And I generally mean that, like, and I guess you guys know what I'm talking about, too, because, like, you know... You, oh, like, some of you, maybe some of you don't like it, but, but like... Oh, not my intention! I should have done more. I don't know why I jumped off that. Okay, let's travel back then to his office. Colony Lambda, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, that was like a little quest. Like, it would have been more difficult if we did it when, like, I guess when they kind of intended us for to, to do it. But, like, I just didn't even think about it at the time. I thought it was just going to be a normal side quest. Uh, but we'll head up here now and do it. Because why not? I don't know. There's a warrant on visitors, I guess, so, I guess is what I'm saying. I wanted to thank you all somehow. We didn't lend a hand just so you'd give us something in return. Too right. We don't expect any thanks. That may be so, but... Oh, yeah. Did the thing with the autolevs get sorted out? I only just got a report saying they don't know why they won't work. After seeing that cave-in, I want to investigate thoroughly. An autolev is vital for that investigation. If we can't bring them back here, they can't be of any use to us. Here it comes. <laughs> I'm not planning on getting you involved for every little thing. I know we want to, though. I can't thank you enough for your help with the cave -in. Excuse me, Commander. I have a report about the autonomous Levnesses. Any new developments? Yes, sir. It seems they're operational. I see. They wanted you to take a look and judge if they can be used or not, sir. Roger that. 
Well, I'm sorry for bringing you all out here. I have to go. I'd like to come along. What do you mean? Oh, good call. I need some closure on this. Yeah, like, I, I'm... I'm way. Yeah. Is that okay? I'm in the same boat as well. Like, I kind of want to see where this ends, too. Then follow me. I love that Lance was totally expecting it, though, as well. Like, hey, at this stage, like, something's going to happen. Like, like uh, we're going to be roped into another quest. Uh, where about to go in this region? Up to here. Where's the nearest place we can go from here? Whoa, um... Is there a ladder around here? I think we can just travel up here, right? Titan Rock Camp, maybe? Maybe we can go go travel from out here. I think there's like a very nearby stair ladder, though, that we can just travel back from here. Who's in our group now? Oh, it's Izzard. Okay. Follow me. More like follow me, Izzard. Watch this. You watching me? The music here... In the best way possible, reminds me of the Zoras. And, like, that's a... If anyone knows my Zelda playthroughs, knows that I love the Zoras. The Zoras are some of the most magical, like, civilizations you'll ever see in your life. So when I say, like, you're like the Zoras... All under control. I freaking adore that. I adore it. Look at this. And it is because the water's here as well, and the music and the vibe and everything. It just feels very, um... Zora-ish. Which, again, there's no bigger compliment for me. It just feels good. It feels very good. Get a few of these items as well. And also, we're gonna, like, Tyan is gonna have to, like, boost up. He's got, he has two great classes now. Two awesome classes now. I'm assuming he's gonna exactly get Izzard's class. Call an open schedule. Sorry. I know this is selfish. Nah, mate, I don't blame you. I may owe Commander Izzard a great debt, but he's also someone I just want to help, even if I didn't owe him. I think every soldier in Lambda probably feels the same. It sounds nice, doesn't it? Feeling an attachment to your colony, to your commander. Yeah, definitely. <gasps> what happened? Hey, what is, is everything okay? <laughs> Commander, the Levnesses, they started moving all of a sudden. What? And then they just came for us. But By themselves? But unit should have safeguards to stop it attacking us. Yeah. Ah! That came from right up ahead. Oh, Jesus Christ. Huh. Lucky thing we tagged along. Yeah, ahead. very lucky. Please, stay back, Commander. We can take it. What are you saying, man? I'm fighting. It'd be a lousy example for the troops if I just stood around and True. stared. True. Nothing inspires more um, hope than seeing your commander fight alongside you. Oh, you Mio was just jumping right into that. Oh, is this who we're fighting? Okay, let's do it. Well, we're doing this. Oh, there's two of them. There's two big boys. You poor things. And you thought that you were gonna. Oh my God, they're already doing good damage to us though. Oh, you thought that was gonna hurt me? This is a nice little quest as well, though. Multi-blast as well right here coming up. Like, that's like, we actually do a lot of healing as well. Hidden Thorn as well. And who else called Armadillo? I doesn't, at least it doesn't have like a rage, but I guess because it's not an animal, like how would it get a, 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 like rage, you know what I mean? It wouldn't make too much sense. I love Blaze as a move. And the music. You asked for this. I wasn't going to do it, but you asked for this, so. It's not my fault at this stage. Get it as soon as possible. Don't even wait for the cancelling of an attack. Look at that! Look at that! That's so sick. I can't wait to use Razor Leaf though. I genuinely can't wait to use it. Now now that we have like only one enemy attacking as well, this is gonna be even easier. Is 
that move takes so long to connect, as it should. It's a big, gigantic move. We have, like, so many healing moves as well. Oh, let's, yeah, let's do a chain attack. Are you kidding me? Always. They're so fun. They're so fun for me. So let's do War of Attrition. Just, yeah, I didn't even look at it, but I, I want to use it. Uh, let's start with a... A little bit of multi-blast. Then let's do a little bit of a hidden thorn. Get up that uh, TP a bit. That's going to get up to like 89. Great. Then we'll do Razor Wind, the greatest thing that's ever been created in Xenoblade. And it heals as well. Like, that's insane. Right? That's insane. War of Attrition. Let's see it. I think it's great for tie-in as well that we have this also, right? Uh, let's do Crave Assault. As an order. Uh, start off with this. Uh, then let's do... Uh, this, maybe? Because it's 44. I think we could... No, we're definitely not going to get up to what we needed to. Yeah, we weren't going to get it up to what we needed to. Maybe we actually could have at this point. Glitter Stream. It's cool. It's cool. And we get a Brave Assault. And a reactivation of this boy as well. Uh, I guess we'll do Pinion Prime just because I love it. Let's start off with uh, this. First blood style. Multiplication. I have a plan for this. Yeah, it's overkill time as well. Get a higher percentage on that too. Um, and it's a myopic screen. And how could you ever resist the greatest move in Xenoblade history? The Razor Wind. Pinion Prime just looks cool. I think it looks cooler with the guns, but like still, it's it's a really good move. Look at that percentage go up as well. A uh, Bravo as well. And a reactivation. Are you kidding me? So we got Pinion Primed, and I guess we could do Art of Subjugation, but like it's not going to matter too much. Uh, like it's pretty much sorted here as well. Look at this. Pure overkill as well. This isn't even funny at this stage. <laughs> Razor win time. Like it's, the percentage is going to go up so high too. And we get to see it with this sword as well. We're, we're just going for it? We just get to go for it? I mean... Oh my god, it's gonna. If this multiplies, it's over already. Oh my god, it's so close. Let's go for it. We're just trying for the XP bonus at this point. Like, it's a level 29 creature. It's not gonna get us a lot of XP. But, like, it's good to get it in the practice, right? And we're gonna get a Bravo anyway. Uh, Leah likes to go for it. Nice little Razor Wind. That's not even funny the amount of TP we got from that. Land's going for it as well. Look. I suppose Land's and Senna. No, we destroyed it. Don't do this thing to me. The belly put a dent in it. Barely put a dent in it. Oi, the spark you doing? 
Was that Izzard? Izzard's getting the hero moment. Right. Giving it to Tyon as well. Again, like, Tyon needed this. I really feel like he needed this interaction with Izzard. Like, this is a side quest, but without this, I feel like Tyon's story is even incomplete. You know what I mean? I feel like it's totally incomplete. He needed this. Nice one. Brilliant work, Tyon. Oh, the smile! Ah! Tyon, the smile! Music as well, so good. Look at this, Commander Izzard. I like. I'm so happy for Tyon. I'm so happy for Tyon and Izzard as well. It's over. Oh, look at that! Right in the back is like, you know what that robot got hit in the back, and it's exactly like what it's like when you do get hit in the back. It's like oh, <laughs> and you like freeze up a bit. Awesome. It feels like all I do is ask you to clean up our messes. Thanks again, if there's anything I can do. But why did they go berserk? It might have been set so they couldn't tell between friend and foe once restarted. Right. You think Who so? would do that? So you're saying that forcing them to restart overwrote the previous instructions? Oh, man. I'll have engineering give me the details. We need them in running order, but they can be dangerous tools, so care is paramount. Regardless... Let me know if there's any way I can thank you. We told you before, we didn't do this for any reward. Won't fly. I can't rest easy knowing I'm this deep in someone else's debt. If you're going to insist... Do we need anything, guys? Uh, let me think. Alright, I've got something. Right away, Whatever Tyon. Whatever it is, just say the word. We've put you out of your way. I want you to fight by our side once more. Oh. Say that again. I want you to see for yourself that the path I'm walking is the right one, Commander. Tyon, has this been bothering you? Of course it has. I understand. My position as Commander means I probably won't be able to accompany you at all times. Of course. But I pledge myself and Colony Lambda to you, Tyon. No, to <sighs> all of you. We're gaining so many allies as well, you know? Me, I'll come running no matter what. Thank you very much, Commander. I better brush up on my skills to keep up with you all. <laughs> Colony Lambda will have to keep up with its current developments, too. We can help you with stuff like that, mate. Now look here, I can't ask that of you. Look, we're friends now. Nothing wrong with asking your friends for help. Fact! Heh. <laughs> we're friends, you say. You're incredibly trusting, you know that. What's that supposed to mean? We're just helping. I don't mean anything bad by it. If I need you, I'll ask for you. Thank you. Please, thank you. Anytime you need. Like I said, Tyon needed this. Friends like you, Tyon. Oh my God! <laughs> it's so beautiful because it's exactly like the exact thing Tyon needed. And what I mean by that is like I feel like Tyon needed to know that like even because of his past mistakes and past failures, like he can still like have not only get respect from Commander Izzard, but fight alongside Commander Izzard like before. And I feel like that's the perfect way to honor the people who have passed away because of Tyon's mistake. And it's gonna be Tyon. There's no way it can be anyone else. Yeah. There's no way. Tyon now has two freaking awesome classes. Possess the arts that heal allies and weaken enemies. Oh, okay, cool. It's like, a, yeah, as I said, a versatile class. Guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all very, very soon. Freaking awesome. So good to have a, a, like a, that resolve there for um, our boy Tyon. I'm so happy for him. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye bye. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do, yeah?